friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach. I follow Weight Watchers and I count calories and macros. Happy Saturday, it's Saturday. It's a special grocery haul. Not only is it a huge haul because I went to Sam's Club and a Kroger store, it is also the healthy, getting into 2023, clean eating, changing my diet, Hall. You're going to see a lot of really healthy foods. I found some great new food finds and I am really, really excited. I am planning ahead and I am ready for January 1st. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not because I do a grocery haul every Saturday and I upload five videos per week. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching. Definitely have your macros and calories done before the new year so that you can reach all of your 2023 goals. And I have one-on-one -on -one coaching if you would like to chat with me directly. Links and discounts to my favorite things and my Facebook group down in the description box Come join us, we'd love to have you. So let me flip you around and let's jump in to this massive grocery haul. Before we start today's grocery haul, I just got my Motivate order in and a lot of you have been asking me what Motivate products are my favorite and I just got a couple of restocks of a couple of my favorites that I haven't shared with you guys here on my channel. So I wanted to share the two products that I have been loving that are great to start out the new year with to really get back on track after the holidays, after all the junk food that we eat over the holidays, these two products are going to be really beneficial for you. First up is the Motivate Detox. It's specifically designed to help you beat the bloat. Its detoxifying formula provides a full body cleanse and digestive support. It helps increase the ability to digest food, absorption of nutrients, and may alleviate many common digestive disorders. What's in here is bentonite clay and psyllium seed. And a few of the other ingredients in here are going to be cascara, sagrada, peppermint leaves, and aloe, all of which are really great to help remove toxins from the body. Now our body detoxifies naturally through our liver, but a supplement like this just really helps beat the blow. And I know for me, when I eat a lot of carbohydrates or a lot of sugar or processed foods in general, I can be pretty bloated. And this definitely makes a big difference in the holiday post-holiday bloat. The other couple ingredients in here that I really like is barberry and turkey rhubarb. Those are both really great ingredients that help with the detox supplement. It's a great supplement for number two, helps support healthy weight loss, supports digestion, and helps you absorb nutrients. You take two capsules, done for the day, and you get to reap all the rewards. So this is actually my second bottle because I love it that much. The other thing are the Motivate Greens. So I decided for fun to order the Motivate Greens to test them out. I hate most green supplements because they taste like grass. I order the tangerine. I really like that flavor. It is 100% sugar-free. It supplies you with super antioxidants, fruits, vegetables, fiber, and enzymes all in one delicious drink. It contains organic ingredients and never any artificial dyes, colors, sweeteners, or flavors. The digestive enzyme and fiber blend ensure your digestive system is functioning at its best by absorbing key nutrients and promoting regularity. It's going to help support optimal nutrition. It's a great source of alkalizing minerals. It includes fiber for digestion digestive support and has powerful antioxidants also for immune support. Just a really great greens, no grassy flavor, excellent taste, excellent texture. It's not gritty at all. It contains alkalizing greens and a fiber blend and it just helps you get your greens in. I know for me, I struggle to get my greens in. So I really have been liking this. I really, really love the flavor. I can't wait to try some of the other options. I like to take my greens in the morning. You can mix it in with water. You could put it in with a smoothie or a protein shake or your favorite protein beverage. And it's just a great way to get your greens in every day. So I wanted to share both of these with you. You guys know how much I love the Motivate products. I will link Motivate down below with a discount code for you. Add these to your cart. You know, I love the burn, the amino. They have so many amazing supplements. They're absolutely my go-to supplement company. So here is my big grocery haul from both Kroger or Fry's, so a Kroger store. And then I did my monthly stock up haul at Sam's Club. I found some new healthy food finds. I'm really excited to focus on cleaning up my diet and eating a real whole food diet moving into the new year. So I made sure that I planned and prepped my house for success. So let me show you what I picked up.
My favorite cottage cheese in the world is Good Culture and it is really affordable at Fry's or Kroger, $3.99. And I wanna say they charge $5.99 at Sprout. So I went ahead and picked up three. Both Troy and I love cottage cheese. It's a really, really good source of protein. And then I grabbed some stir fry sauce because I found a bag of stir fry vegetables on a really good deal and I'm going to make up a quick stir fry for a healthy meal. They had their 99% ground turkey on sale for $4.29 a pound. So I picked up two. I'm just going to throw them in my freezer. I also grabbed the Mighty Spark spinach and feta all chicken burgers. These are really, really good, these little patties. I shared them in a What I Eat in a Day quite a while ago. They have a lot of flavor, 23 grams of protein and nice, clean ingredients. They're just a really easy, high protein meal. And then I saw this on sale for $1.60 and thought that I would try it. This is the kale artichoke creamy dip. I did buy a lot of vegetables, so I thought that I could dip the vegetables in this dip. This is from the brand Fresh Cravings. I've actually never heard of it, but I thought for the price, I would give it a try. And then at the checkout, I saw this protein bar. This is from the brand Fulfill, and this has 15 grams of protein, one gram of sugar, vitamins, minerals in it, and it's only 160 calories, which I thought was pretty good. This is a chocolate peanut caramel. So it sounded really good. I thought that I would give it a try. I did pick up another container of light sour cream. I'm going to make some more dip for our veggies. I needed a couple of seasoning mixes for a dinner recipe. First I needed a brown gravy and then a zesty Italian seasoning pack. It's got a little discombobulated, but this is the no sugar added mandarin oranges. Troy asked for these. He likes to put these on cottage cheese. So drain the juice and then throw them on some cottage cheese. It makes a really good snack. These I've purchased before. I actually have eaten these a couple times before working out and they were on clearance for 89 cents. I ate one today on my way to Sam's Club. These are the Bliss Bento Boxes. This is the Berry Lemony. So there's blueberries, lemon, coconut, granola clusters, and yogurt almonds. These are really good, 220 calories, and you're going to get about 10 grams of protein. So I liked having these just as a quick, easy snack. Some frozen corn, this is for my meal prep. And then I needed a big bag of baby carrots. I'm going to be making a pot roast this week. And then again, baby carrots are great for dipping. I needed one orange for some orange zest, a red onion, quite a few zucchinis for a couple of different recipes. I did decide to go ahead and pick up a spaghetti squash because I've really been loving spaghetti squash. If you missed Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day, I shared a really good lasagna recipe using spaghetti squash. So I'll link my What I Eat in a Day down below for you. These are those stir fried vegetables that I mentioned. It was on sale for $2.10. It included a sauce, but I didn't know if I would like it. So I grabbed the stir fry sauce just in case. I did grab one red bell pepper for a recipe. I needed some butternut squash cubes for my meal prep. I was going to grab them at Sam's. Good thing I didn't because they didn't have them. So I'm glad that I picked them up at Fry's. And then I got a lot of mushrooms because look at the price, 96 cents. So I picked up two packs of whole mushrooms and a pack of sliced mushrooms. I like to dip the whole mushrooms in dip in veggies and we love mushrooms in this house. So we'll definitely use those. The first thing I grabbed at Sam's Club is toilet paper. I usually buy it at Costco, but because Diesel's medication is only filled every other month, I don't go to Costco as often, so I stocked up at Sam's Club. I had their Downy scent beads for laundry on sale for $13. I really liked the smell of this refresh. I'd never purchased it before, so I grabbed that. Some Canadian bacon. This is such a great source of protein. It's uncured, which is really what I'm after when it comes to meats and uncured meat. So I saw that it was an uncured Canadian bacon had to grab it. I also picked up a huge bake of little tiny baby potatoes. This is for the pot roast. And then I do have a sheet pan dinner using potatoes on the menu. A gallon of 1% milk for Troy. And then this is a great deal. This was $10 for 24 crock pot liners. I pay $4, I think for four of them at the store. So that was an incredible deal. I definitely snatched that as soon as I saw it. Some nonstick cooking spray, olive oil. I'm almost out of my chosen foods avocado oil. I will grab that next time I'm at Costco but this will definitely get me by until then. And then I did grab some fully cooked bacon for Troy. He likes to have these on his breakfast sandwiches. Really easy, it's already cooked. All you do is throw it in the microwave for a couple seconds to get it nice and crispy. 
it's just convenient. So I grabbed that. Since Costco doesn't have the dog's hip and joint medicine anymore, I saw that Sam's Club did. These are definitely smaller bags, not as good of a deal, but they're really good, especially for Diesel and Lola because they're older. It just helps with their joints. It has omega-3s, glucosamine, all the good things in there. A big box of Oikos Triple Zero Yogurt. I really wanted the Chobani Zero, but they didn't have it. That's a Costco thing, I believe. So this will work. These have 15 grams of protein, 90 calories, this box is strawberry, mixed berry, and vanilla. And I love, as you know, to put my freeze-dried fruit on my yogurt. So I grabbed that. We were almost out of Jif peanut butter. This is the peanut butter Tori uses. So I grabbed a two-pack. I was also out of vanilla extract after all the holiday baking. This was only $10, which is an amazing deal. Also, another thing I'm almost out of after baking for the holidays was my Kerrygold butter. You're going to see, like I said, a lot cleaner recipes, cleaner foods, cleaner diet in the new year. And that includes no longer using light butter. Butter. I'm going to just use real butter and less of it. Of course, when I make recipes, I will give you points using light butter because I know a lot of you count your points on Weight Watchers and want to make sure that you have the lowest point option. But for me, just to really help clean up my diet, I'm just going to switch over to real butter. I did grab some lunch meat. They had uncured Black Forest ham. I was really excited to see that. I like putting a string cheese in here and rolling it up for a quick high protein snack. I like to make avocado toast with this, sandwiches, wraps, so this will definitely get good use. I also decided to grab hummus just for a healthy fat, a little bit of protein, another good snack item with crackers or vegetables, and this was less than $5 for this huge container, which is a great deal. We jacked cheese slices. For Troy, he asked for some more cheese slices, and then I did grab some fruit. The blueberries were $3.50 and the raspberries were $5. I thought that was a really good deal. And then of course, mini cucumbers because I didn't go to Sprouts. These are only $3, $3.22 I think at Sam's Club. And with the dip that I'm making and all the baby carrots and mushrooms, I'm just going to load up on veggies for the week. And then I decided to get some pre-hard boiled cage-free eggs. These are in little packages, which I really like because you can take them on the go. They're already peeled, ready to go. Two eggs per pack. So you're getting 12 grams of protein. Really, really good thing to have on hand. And it's much easier than having to make them myself, peel them, put them in the fridge. And I know Troy will eat these as well because they're individually packaged. I grabbed some more Reyes marinara because I am completely out of spaghetti sauce. And this one has nice, clean ingredients. I found this trail mix and I was pretty excited about it. This is the Omega Powerhouse trail mix. 12 grams of protein, which is almost unheard of in trail mix. So you're going to have almonds, pumpkin seeds, protein, chocolate flavored chips. That was interesting. Walnuts, protein, granola clusters, strawberries, strawberry flavored cranberries, banana chips, and banana clusters. I thought that sounded really, really good. There's some omega-3s in here, non-GMO. They were a little bit, it is a little bit higher in calories. Quarter cup, 180, per quarter cup, or 12 grams and a half of a cup. So I'm excited to have this nice clean ingredients, nothing other than what I mentioned. See these, they actually had the dark chocolate strawberry and the white chocolate strawberry. So I decided to get the white chocolate. This is from the brand True Fru. I love their frozen chocolate covered fruit. Super, super clean ingredients. These are basically just big chocolate covered strawberries. They're 150 calories per serving. I mean, they're big. I would say about that big. So for me, I may just have one or two as a sweet treat, but I thought good quality ingredient treat. And then I restocked some protein shakes. I was hoping they had the winter mint from Premier, but they didn't. And I haven't had a vanilla protein shake in a while. And I want them also for my protein pudding recipe video that will be coming out in the month of January. So I grabbed that. And then Fairlife chocolate. I really like the chocolate, especially for protein pudding. It was the only Fairlife flavor they had. So I grabbed it. What's not shown is a case of no sugar Gatorade or Gatorade Zero for Troy, Coors Light, and Diet Coke. So that is everything in my big healthy food grocery haul. Let's go ahead and jump into what's on my menu for dinners and the healthy recipes you'll be seeing in Monday's meal prep. So here is what is on my menu for the week. So today's Saturday, out to dinner, leftovers. Tomorrow, Sunday, I'm making slow cooker herbed chicken and potatoes. Monday, I'm going to do a gnocchi sheet pan dinner. You guys will actually see this recipe in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day, so stay tuned for that. Tuesday, we do leftovers. Wednesday, I'm throwing a pot roast in the crock pot. Probably gonna do tacos on Thursday, and then Friday, we do leftovers as well to finish up everything from earlier in the week. 
And here's what you'll be seeing in Monday's meal prep. Nice, healthy recipes. For breakfast, we're doing a zucchini, egg, and corn casserole. I'm actually really excited for this. It's a great way to get in veggies for breakfast. Lunch is going to be sweet potato chili, another thing I'm super excited about. And then for dessert, I'm making chocolate oatmeal protein bars. So I'm going to try my hand at homemade protein bars. That way I can control all the ingredients. So definitely stay tuned for Monday's meal prep. Thank you for joining me for today's grocery haul. I hope you are as excited as I am for all the clean, healthy recipes coming your way in the new year. I am going to be chopping up fruits, vegetables, getting everything ready this afternoon. I really like to plan ahead so that I can be successful. Big, big game changer just doing a little bit of planning earlier in the week. If you enjoyed the grocery haul, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not. I'd love to have you here and don't forget to check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things and come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.